Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. This is my um, little video about skincare, having healthy skin. So I'm going to share with you some of the little tricks and tips that I use, if they may be of interest. We'll see how we go. And let's get into the video. So I wanted to share some of my skin um, routine with you so if anyone is interested people are always saying that oh you look so young you don't look like you're this age and so I just think it's nice to just share anything that you might be doing that might you know someone else might be inspired by it so let's move this back a little bit that's better so first of all I'm going to show you, you something which I have used a brush like this literally since I was like 18 years old. I don't know, maybe some like spa thing that I went to talked about dry skin brushing. And at first I just started doing it like everyone does, like, oh, I've heard that this is really good. And then I kind of like started doing it so regularly that my skin now, if I don't brush my skin, my skin lets me know. And so if I have like a week where I haven't dry skin brushed, my skin will start to really feel it and I'll be like, oh my God, I'll get my brush, I need my brush. And I just use like circular motions and this really gets the lymphatic system working. Our lymph system is what pumps out waste pretty much and our skin is the biggest organ on our body and we shed a lot of waste through the skin so I skim, dry skin brush everywhere even in my scalp I'm like ooh so I just get that circular motion going on so that is my absolute amazing thing to share with you the next thing is this. This is a just a roller. It's a jade roller. And when I've cleansed um, and before I moisturize, I just kind of like roll my skin. And this kind of like stimulates collagen growth. And it's just really lovely. It's really cooling. And I've used that for probably over a year. And I just really like love getting the getting the rolling in there. Just feels really good. So that's something that um, helps me to stay young looking. I like to use a facial oil. So this is a little bit of a um, a rip off of Pixie, and I think Pixie is about I don't know like twenty odd pounds. This is Aldi's version. It's cruelty free, and it's a beautiful rose oil and I just put a couple of drops into my hand, rub it together and I just moisturise it into my skin. I use that underneath makeup and I also use it underneath my moisturiser at night. Again with moisturisers and products, I'm not like a big loyal fan of any particular brand. I just go for the things that don't test on animals or are cruelty free. So, and if they're good, I'll use them for as long as, as I can. But really, it comes down to hydration. So, for your skin to be plump, it needs to be hydrated from the inside. And I can get really, really kind of creasy, old-looking skin when I'm dehydrated. So, if I... Um, if I've eaten things like bread and biscuits, processed foods, they act like a sponge and they like suck in all the um, hydration out of your body. And they, it's very difficult to replace that. But fruits and vegetables are full of hydration but also vitamin rich. So when you eat a lot of fruit and veg, you're hydrating your body but you're doing it in a nutritious way 
whereas when you drink water your cells can only absorb so much and they like things to be absorbed slowly which is why food has the fiber to slow down the um, absorption when you drink a lot of water you'll go to the toilet a lot because you'll just pee most of it out so hydrating foods and trying to avoid the foods that really soak up hydration is a, a real key point the next thing is avoiding the sunshine because if you look at sun-dried tomato you'll be able to see that it will wrinkle up because it's been dried out in the sun so the sun is very drying but the sun is also very healing we need vitamin d we need to get some sun but you know 15 20 minutes a day of sun is enough to get your vitamin d if you're laying in the sun and worshiping it and you're out in it all the time you're not going to be able to help getting um wrinkles because the sun will damage your skin so what else what else what else what else so food sun i also do um facial exercises i figure that you know if you're going to tone your body and you're going to build up the muscles in your body you're going to change the shape it's the same with your face if you don't have very strong muscles in your face then they'll start to shrink and the skin will be looser so you can do some facial exercises which is maybe for another video or you can check a video out a video out of someone doing facial exercises so sorry but my battery died through the towards the um back end of that last part about facial exercises so if the settings have changed slightly then it's just because of that so yeah facial exercises just like exercising your body you can change the shape of your face so that is another thing that I do um, what else most importantly sleep I'm not great with sleep but I'm really trying at the moment to try and get a good schedule going on but sleep will definitely help your skin because when we sleep we repair so that is my skincare regime that's what happens in my life so I hope you like that I hope you got something from it if you did please give us a thumbs up and press subscribe if you like this channel I'm going to be making lots more take care bye 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 bye